All right, let's take a look at those current temperatures today across northwest Arkansas, reaching up into the high 90s just outside of the triple digits across the River Valley, reaching up into those triple digits, and it's going to be several days until we dip below that. Take a look at those current temperatures right now. 98 in Fayetteville, 97 in Bentonville and 97 in Salem Springs across the River Valley, 102 currently in Greenwood, 102 in Boonville and 101 in Fort Smith. And like I mentioned again, throughout the rest of this upcoming week, we're going to continue to see the potential for those triple digits until we get until next weekend. Take a look at what it actually feels like outside when you factor in that humidity. It feels like we're around the 110 to 115 mark across the River Valley, across northwest Arkansas, 105 to 110. That's why we have that heat advisory and those excessive heat warnings for today. Take a look at that humidity. Again, not as oppressive as we saw last week where we saw those high 80s. Now we're just seeing those 70s, but this is going to continue to grow throughout most of this upcoming week. Eventually, we'll get closer to those 80s for those dew point values. Right now, only in the high 60s to mid 70s for today and heading into tomorrow. Expected wind gusts throughout the rest of the night tonight going to get a bit breezy, especially once we head into the overnight hours. Those gusts picking up near 15 miles per hour. Those sustained winds, though, only going to remain into the single digits. So heading into tomorrow morning, plenty of sunshine for our Sunday as that high pressure continues to dominate. Temperatures in the morning going to be up into the high 70s across the River Valley, across northwest Arkansas. Expect those mid 70s heading into tomorrow morning. And of course, by the time we get into the afternoon, going to see those triple digits all across five country expect 100, digit, 100 degrees across northwest Arkansas and above that across the River Valley heat index values again expected to be around that 115 mark. Let's take a look at the humidity again throughout the rest of this upcoming week. That humidity is just going to continue to be oppressive and that high pressure system is going to continue to sit right over us creating a lot of sunshine and no rain chances throughout the rest of this upcoming week. You see those high 70s throughout most of this upcoming week across five country getting up near those tropical levels when we factor in that humidity. That's going to last until we get into closer towards this upcoming weekend when we see that next cold front arrive heading into Friday and into Saturday. Take a look at what this high pressure system looks like just kind of moving around but really staying over northwest Arkansas and the River Valley creating this heat dome across five country for the next several days. That's why we have those temperatures reaching up above the triple digits at least until we get into next weekend when we expect that next cold front to arrive. So take a look at those heat index values are going, going to be around that 110 to 115 mark throughout the rest of this week and into the first half of the week and through the rest of your work week, we're going to see those heat index values again above 100 degrees, anywhere from that 105 to 115 mark by the time we get to Friday. Take a look across northwest Arkansas the rest of this week. Again, lots of sunshine, no rain chances until maybe we get into next weekend. Temperature is going to be up into the high 90s in those triple digits for northwest Arkansas. Across the River Valley, you see temperatures well above the triple digits, at least throughout the rest of this upcoming week. Going to see lots and lots of sunshine, though. That's a good sign. It's going to be nice weather, but it's going going to be very hot and humid weather that the rest of this upcoming week. I know you were talking about earlier last week. It was beautiful. I know. Last <laughs> week in the morning, I was like, it's back to school weather. It was cool and mm -hmm. crisp, but now we just got to hang on until next weekend. Yeah, I had those 80s last weekend, and hopefully by the time we get into this next weekend, we're going to see those 80s return after that next cold front arrives. <sighs> well, we're so ready for that. Like, well, we'll be waiting on it. Yeah, thanks, Stephen.